That is what we wanted to hear. Welcome to the Across the Park into the match reaction. Everton 2, Arsenal 1. Uh, I'm, I'm surprised I've still got my voice. What a game. Two disallowed goals. 1 0 down. Back against it. I mean. Dave, I'll come to you. Dave's with us tonight. Yeah, unexpected. What we were asking questions all over the table in the table today. I think we were the better side from the off, and it was a good win. God, I'm, honestly, I'm buzzing because like, I, I think I said to you at the end, it was like, it was a David Moyes performance. You know, we watched them, them get a win at the weekend, West Ham against Chelsea, and I'm looking at them thinking, you know, that, that's the type of victory I want to see us. Uh, you know, I want to see that battle good as that, That's what Everton's all about. Yeah, it is, yeah. There's two different Everton. There's the Everton last week yeah. and then Everton tonight. And we were flat. I tell you what, the first minute, see, we were all flat. By the close of half, the Knicks and Townsend just come out the box straight from the kickoff. Throws it down, then come out the box. I mean, Benny says it. I had a little bit of in the week, so I don't know Like, we were all the Liverpool last week, and I didn't see it because of the game, so I'll play last week. But, like you say, yeah, we absolutely ran. Every player ran themselves into the ground tonight. Even Gordon sprinting off the pitch. Yeah. And we were doubting that too. We've got to say, we all thought Grey should have went off. He looked gassed, but wow. Yeah. What a finish to the what game. A goal. I mean, what a, a couple of things goal. I want to touch on. The two disallowed goals. I mean, the one in the first half, probably more offside than the second one. That second one. I mean, fortunately, we're not having to look back at it with too much regret. We're disappointed, isn't it? Well, can I just say something about that goal? Because I was downstairs getting the ailing. I missed that. First one. I seen the goal, yeah. So I seen yeah. the goal. Thinking we're 1 0 up. Right, go down, get the ailing. And then the next thing is, I come up one half time. No, no, I still think it's 4 1 1. Because yeah, yeah. they scored, didn't they? They missed that one. Oh, well, you didn't so know I was disallowed? No, no, I thought <laughs> was disallowed. Brilliant. And then Arsenal are all singing 1 0 to the Arsenal, 1 0 to the Arsenal. And I'm thinking, why are you singing that? And then I look up. <laughs> <laughs> and then I look, at the, look up at the scoreboard. And I'm going, what's that? And I was talking to Marty next door. And I'm going, what happened there? Oh, my God, I can't believe that, it. But two disallowed goals. You know, and you think, oh, it's not going to happen tonight. It's just not going to happen. And we're, we're doomed, but. Dave, we kept that, didn't we? We figured it weren't our day, didn't we? We thought it weren't our day today. We, we said, didn't we? Gordon sprinted off. We said that was the wrong substitution. And that Gray turns up and pings it. I mean, I, the only thing you said, I think I said to you, you, you know, maybe Gray has just got a goal in him. And, you know, we, we always forgot that he, he set up Charleston's goal, didn't he, with that effort that comes off the bar, which without Ramsdale getting a touch on it. Charleston, I think. Charleston, he was brilliant, like Dave said. The should have been out. If he's on it, I, I said to you that after five minutes, he's on it today. They were all up for it tonight, though. Receiving on the back foot, he's driving the defenders. It's like you just want to see him look like he was playing with the shackles off tonight. Yeah. But he, weren't, he didn't care if he lost the ball, he'd be getting it, driving at them, using his physicality. And I always feel like he's been a little bit too cute this season, trying to play like. Smart when you just want to see that physical for Charles, don't you? Yeah, yeah, it's a physical element, that's what you want to see. Yeah, I'll tell you what, the defence were great tonight, you know. Yeah. There were some excellent blocks from Godfrey, James Coleman, they were like certain goals. They had to do right. pick in the spots, and the next minute, just come in from nowhere, just slid in and put a block in. It's fantastic. I mean, after when it went to 1 1, it was a proper end to end game, weren't it? I mean, Ketia, Alders and Ketia missed out on the back post. Yeah, yeah, that's a goal. As soon as it landed on his head, it went to half the goal. It's a goal. And he hit the post. Well, we've got to touch on for anyone who wasn't on the ground, obviously there's a lot made of this 27 minute thing and if you watch it on the telly, they may not have showed much. We've got to say, there must have been over 40 people in the park end, but what was great, you said it, as soon as it got to the 27 minute, the fans who were staying recognised it and got right behind the team. Right behind the team. And yeah. I think some of them players must have been thinking, oh, we're dreading the 27th minute, thinking, yeah. this is awkward, this, they're all actually... Was anyone who walked up? No, there wasn't. There was about half a dozen. It was, and it, it, it was a little bit awkward, wasn't it? But, yeah, but what, 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 the best wait, thing. yeah, but from that then, the whole crowd yeah. just got behind them, didn't they? And they, and they saw some enough from that, and we're getting behind them. Exactly. And, they did. And, and, and some would say we lost a little bit of that since we've got to be on the game. Because the, 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 the players, yeah. we haven't associated with the players for so long, but the yeah, likes of Godfrey, Godfrey Knight, rattled into that tackle in the first minute, didn't they? They all put a shift in. Yeah. They were committed tonight, you could just see it, couldn't you? And you could see, like, when no way we're going to lose this tonight. Went two goals. Two off yeah, two off sides. I mean, oh, I, honestly, I'm, I'm actually surprised I've got a voice here because I was trying oh to see it at the end. Oh, my God. Oh, what, what a, well, I mean, what a, game, what a difference and what a contrast. Game. You know, you're looking for a reaction from the players, not only from the derby, right. but from that run. I honestly think that that finish is 1 0. And he says it's probably on the brink, you know, just because you're thinking, you know, when you know, one of them moves where you think there needs to be a change in order to. Even if we walked out, I think we should have won 2 1. Have got yeah, that could have happened today. We yeah. should have won a 4-1, really. Not another day, most of them goals have been ours. 
And I went, you know what I also made the quote as well? They were horrible Arsenal. They're not horrible in like a foul yeah, way. Like, it's just a little bit like Dave said, you're like fake injuries. Yeah. They told you they had the timeouts at one point. They yeah, forgot to have I said that to you, I said they had like a timeout. The whole, the rest of the team went over to Arteta for a little team talk while he's down with cramp. Yeah. Yeah. He, was, he, was, he got snapped, went down, didn't the rest of the game, straight back. He got back up, it was Ben yeah. White that, Ben White. He did it too early, Arteta did that too early, he started doing a round half an hour to go. That's he it, Arteta, I think Arteta's a good sense, he knows he's played a good night like this. When, you know, maybe Evan haven't got the yeah. best players, so he, he knows the ground where that quiet. Get, you know, get up for it, all ground to, he's yeah. so close to the pitch, and I think he can see his players getting a little bit rattled by it. Well, listen, Millsy had a rant a minute. Anyone who watches that into the match reaction, Millsy had a proper rant after the Liverpool game, and, and it, you know, it was it, it almost went viral. But I mean, my it's not a rant tonight. It's it's a bit of a rallying call to say, look, Blues, that that's what we can do. That's what the fans can do. We can get behind that team. And like you say, Kevin, it was great to see the players feeling it. And we've seen them at the end. They were all together. You know? That's that's one of them games. Millsy's not here by the way, Millsy stayed at home, Pricey's not here, Pricey stayed at home. That's what being an Evertonian's about boys, it's about getting there when the chips are down, <laughs> and when it's hard to turn up, you know what I mean? And you can be out there watching oh, from home now. They'll be cringing watching this yeah. now. But honestly, for the, uh, listen, for the benefit of the ones who want there, it was a proper Everton night. Yeah, 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 one of the great nights, one of the great nights. Yeah, and Dave joins us from the main stand to the park end tonight. No prawn sandwiches tonight. It's fine, Dad. It's fine. Good, it's fine. All good. So, yeah. My dad thought he messed up the instant match reaction there, so sorry yeah, about yeah. that. <laughs> it's not me, good. <laughs> From the park end tonight, we've had a change of scene. We've had a change of attendance or a change of guests. Kev yeah. and Dave are, you know, our lucky mascot, so guilty. Or, oh, Pricey, you have to swap your ticket for Dave and sit in the main stand <laughs> now. Back in the main stand next week. <laughs> Listen, can we just say, did you walk out your living room on 27 minutes? That's what we want to know. Did you go and get a cup did of tea? Did you go put the cow on 27 minutes? <laughs>